Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to insert footnotes and endnotes into a Microsoft Word document. You can see here I have a simple sample document and I'm just going to go ahead and click where I would want to put a foot or an endnote in my document right at the end of this paragraph. And I'm then going to go ahead and go to the References tab up here at the top and you're going to see a footnote section here where we've got Insert Footnote and Insert Endnote. And I can just simply, since I've clicked there, I can click on Insert Footnote and you're going to see that it inserted, let me scroll back up here, the footnote number one there and it placed the footnote down here in the footer. And so now I can go ahead and type in my footnote. I'll just type, this is a sample footnote. And you can format these just like you would any piece of text inside of um, Word. I can highlight a uh, a part of that footnote there and go to the home tab and you can see I've got all of my formatting tools here so I could make this italic if I wanted to or bold or I can set that up and format it however I want. If I wanted to put an endnote into a document I could do it in the exact same way. I could go ahead and click the end of this paragraph here wherever I want the endnote to appear and then go to references and say insert endnote and you're going to see that it brought me to page four in my document and I can say this is a sample end note and if I go ahead and go back to the beginning of my document I can see there is the end note that was inserted also if you hover over that end note you're going to see that it brings up a little yellow tooltip here there that shows you the text of the end note and the same thing is true for the footnote. If I hover over that, again, that little yellow tooltip is going to appear there and it's going to tell me what the footnote is. So that's how you insert footnote and endnotes into a Microsoft Word document. And you're going to also see, if I come in here, there's a show note option there as well. If I click on that, you're going to see that it gives you the option to view either the footnote area on this page or to jump directly to the EndNote area. And I can select either one of those that I want, click OK, and it jumps me to that point. And you can also go from footnote to footnote here. And if I click that drop down, you can go to the previous footnote, and there's also next EndNote or previous EndNote that you can jump back and forth to using that navigation tool. Finally, and let me go ahead and again go to the beginning of my document, you're going to notice that there's this little symbol here in the lower right hand corner of this footnote section. Not every section inside of the ribbon has this little icon here. For instance, underneath citations and bibliography, there's none there none under table and contents but if I go to the home tab you're gonna see there is one in the font section there is one in the paragraph section whenever you see one of these little icons that's gonna bring up a dialog box that allows you to um, see all the different options for that particular item so I'm gonna go ahead and click on that right now and you can see there's my footnote and endnote um, settings and I can click on footnote there and it will show me the footnote styles here. I can set up custom marks, change where the footnoting starts at, so on and so forth. Choose continuous footnote numbering or I can say restart each section or restart on each page. And again if I go to endnote you're going to see the same options here. So again, you get into these options just by clicking on this little icon right here in the lower right hand corner of that section and this dialog box comes up. Thanks for watching.